Hi guys, welcome to Dr. Maya Clinic YouTube channel. Uh, it's the end of the day and I decided to make this video to share something very important with you, which is source of your supplements and vitamins. And why I want to talk about this, because regularly my patients come to me or after I prescribe something to them and tell me that they bought or want to buy a supplement or vitamin or any nutraceutical on Amazon. Now, I always explain to them uh, what are the implications of buying something on Amazon, something like this. And so I decided to make this video to share it with the whole world. So what can you buy on Amazon? And I send my patients to Amazon to buy Acumat, massage mat, uh, gadgets, I don't know, things like that. And I explain why not to buy supplements on Amazon. Now, to start taking a supplement or vitamin, there is a science to it. Uh, you need to know how much, what kind, and what supplement to take. Everybody needs different supplements. You really cannot diagnose yourself that well uh, or at all. There are, uh, so healthcare practitioners, uh, can with their experience we, we can uh, assess what you need to take and also there are specific functional medicine tests exist that will help us define what supplement and how much of it for you to take and a lot of uh, symptoms like uh, practically all the symptoms that you might have and want to overcome uh, somehow tied to a nutritional deficiencies so it is very very important what kind of what you're taking now uh, we provide supplements uh, me and my friends, healthcare practitioners do. Some of us store supplements uh, in our offices and some of us have online pharmacies. Now I have online pharmacy and I like my pharmacy. I create my own little dispensary on the pharmacy. If something new comes up that is a pharmaceutical grade and um, very specialized, I can add it to Dr. My Favorites. And that is a very cool thing to do because it's kind of a dynamic, living, breathing uh, thing. Now, um, why not to buy on Amazon with the Amazon Prime free shipping and a few dollars cheaper? One reason, and it's a very important reason, you don't know where the supplement was stored, where people who put it online are storing it. Maybe they are storing it in their hot garage next to a swamp in Florida and the supplements already started developing mold and uh, mold spores in them and you cannot even see it. Uh, the, the nutrients in them might already be deactivated because of the heat and improper storing conditions. Of course, there is always a possibility that this person is storing it in an air-conditioned and uh, fantastic environment. Uh, not likely, but it's possible. So. I don't like taking chances with my food. Now, food is one thing, and supplements is really concentrated food that are there to correct your nutritional deficiencies, to correct your body function. Why play with that? Why play with something that is actually can go bad and if stored improperly, will go bad? So I decided to make this video because it, I consider it very, very important source of your supplements, source of your food, where are you buying your food? Or where you, uh, with the food, it's easy because you can smell it and it's, it's rotting. You can see mold on it. You're not going to buy it. But with supplements that you bought online, you cannot see it. It's inside the pill. It's inside the capsule and you don't, and it's inside the gel inside the gelatin, you don't know what is inside, or in what condition it is. If it's a fish oil, it can gun rancid, and you don't know what can happen to a supplement when it's stored improperly. So that is what I wanted to share with you, and I hope it was helpful, and ask me questions if you need to, and I will see you next time. Have a fantastic evening. Bye.